Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Bow now, bow now, here comes a Spider-Man! <laughs> What's going on, you guys? Alright, so the first thing when I get up this morning is I find out that the Amazing Spider-Man 2 trailer has been released. So you know I had to do a reaction video, you guys. I love my comic book films. I did enjoy the first one. I liked it. You know, I thought it was a fun movie. So I did like it. I think Andrew Garfield is great as Spider-Man. You know, he definitely brings a little bit more um, of a style to Peter Parker than I think Tobey Maguire did. But anyways, let's jump right into the trailer, you guys. That's cool. I think that's pretty cool. Every day I wake up knowing that the more people I try to save, the more enemies I will make. Oh dang, that's the rhino? It's a matter of time before I face those with more power. Like Electro. I'm so sorry, I'm late. Did your traffic jam have anything to do with being, I don't know, shot at by machine guns? That's yeah, cool. Yeah. Oh, that was implying. That was implying that. He's <laughs> a park. Harry Osborne. You're gonna want to see us. Why does Harry Osborne look like some emo hipster dude? Why? Oh, dang. Oh, shout out to the um, Dr. Octopus reference in the back there. What is all this? The future. We literally can change the world. What about Peter? Oh, is that the Green Goblin? Yep, that's the Green Goblin. Looks like it. <laughs> Why is he wearing a hood? <laughs> okay, now that is pretty freaking cool right there, dude. Alright, so that was it, you guys. That was the uh, Amazing Spider-Man trailer. Um, from a trailer perspective, I don't think you could have asked for more. And I did like that they really didn't give away too much in the trailer. You know that he's going to be fighting, it looks like, three villains at least. Um, it looks like he's going to be fighting um, Jamie Foxx as Electro, uh, What's-His-Face as Rhino. And they didn't let us know who is going to be playing um, the Green Goblin. And I do like that they um, did show in the trailer that they are going to explore a little bit more about what happened to uh, Peter Parker's parents, to Spider-Man's parents. I do like that um, his parents were never really addressed in the first series by Sam Raimi. Like I said, Jamie Foxx, when he's got that hood on as Electro, he reminds me a lot of some of the dudes from Infamous. I don't know which character. The main character and some of the villains. Yeah, not. That's. Get rid of the hood and get a costume. I mean, Spider Man is wearing a costume. I'm pretty sure you guys can fit uh, Electro with a dang costume. So, you know. Rhino looks awesome, though. Uh, he looks like Iron Man. With the rhino suit. That's it, you know. And, and the Green Goblin looked fantastic as well. And that last part of the trailer where Electro and Spider-Man are duking it out. That was just awesome. I think that whole scene right there was, was really great. 
But anyways, you guys, I'm really looking forward to the movie. I hope you guys are too. I did like the first one, but I'm hoping this one is a lot better than the first one. I don't know how they're going to handle three villains um, very well. Because, you know, that's a lot of villains to take on in a two-hour movie. And you know it's going to be two hours, for sure. That's it for this trailer review, you guys. Let me know who is your favorite comic book hero besides Batman and Superman in the comments down below. Um, personally, mine is The Punisher. Um, I know his movies kind of suck, but if you read some of his stuff by uh, Garth Ennis... I mean, the dude is just a man on a mission. Awesome. But let me know in the comments down below, you guys. And, you know, as always, give me a thumbs up. A big old thumbs up. And you guys can always check out my previous video right there. And don't forget to subscribe right over there. And as always, keep buying blues. Keep watching movies. And peace!